Royal Rumble live reaction. Number one is Enzo or Big Cass. It's one of them. What the fuck? It's PS3 fucking up. Oh god. Seriously? Stupid bastard. PS3, man. It's cut off. Stupid wireless controller fucking up. Come on, get back to the rumble. Number one was Enzo or Big Cass. I apologize, it cut out. It's my stupid wireless controller. It just, I don't know, cut off the show. Going back to the menu. Enzo and Cass cutting their Rumble promo. Number one. Is it Enzo or Cass? Who's number one? Got a question for you? What's that, so pretty much common knowledge, I think. Enzo number one. What is it that they say about Texas? Cass number two. I think that it goes something like this. Everything is bigger in Texas. Come on, enough with the promo. Start the match, get in the ring. We don't need to hear a pre-match Royal Rumble promo. Even though I love Enzo on the mic, guy's super entertaining. Start the Rumble. How you doing? 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 But I'll tell you what, none of that matters, because Big Cass is entering this race number one like it's 1995, and he is HBK in his prime. Oh, Cass number one, I would like to see Brock number one and Goldberg number two. That would have been damn entertaining. But I'm okay with Cass being number one. Come on, network. Trying to reload or some crap. It does. Stupid little circle spins around. You know, whoever has the network probably knows what I'm talking about. That little circle in the middle spinning around. Come on, loadery. The fuck? Load. Starting to piss me off, man. Comes on for a second, freezes, does a spinning crap. Cast number one. I would like to see Braun. Braun number two. Maybe Goldberg, no, not Goldberg, Brock number two. I'd like to see that. Maybe Undertaker, but I doubt it. Jericho. Another year. A couple years ago, Jericho, when he returned, I don't know, two, three years ago, he was number one or two. A couple years ago. 
And I'm Jericho has to go the distance if he wants to win this. Why can't Byron call the Rumble with Cole and Corey? Why does Jerry Lawler have to come back? I don't, I don't know why Lawler has to come back, but he's back. John Connington. Every 20, or, sorry, every two minutes in between, and superstars were eliminated by going over the top rope with both. Now they're going over the rules. I already know their goddamn rules. We'll go on to have known the rules for 30 years. Here's an interesting statistic. Over the years, 356 different characters, including you and me, have entered the Royal Rumble match. Only 23 superstars in history have actually won this event. That's how difficult it is. Wow, you're not Jericho taking forever to get to the ring. I would have won that, except Shawn Michaels dropped me out. It's a long walk. I know that. It's in the Alamo Dome. So Jericho and Cass will start this matchup for Chris Jericho. It is an opportunity to better his time from last year. Last year, he lasted 15 minutes in this Royal Rumble match. You don't want to be referred to as the sexy pinata anymore? No, not anymore. Last year, Jericho we go. Cass and Jericho went 15 minutes. Chris Jericho I don't remember that, but his career, entered at number two. that's impressive. Oh, Jericho just slapped Cass. That was a dumb move. Big right hand to the midsection. Slap big Cass. That was stupid as hell. Chris Jericho's, I mean, he's a veteran for sure. He's got a lot of experience, but sometimes I question his strategy. Why would you slap a guy like, oh, big Cass right in the mouth to start the match? There's a far away slam from Cass. You know, Corey, uh, only a, two, the two tallest winners in Royal oh. Rumble match history, Big John Studd and The Undertaker. Big Cass and Sam Hook would join that elite group. Well, I think surprisingly, throughout history, the larger the superstar, the, the worse your luck, you almost find yourself as a target. In this year's Royal Rumble match, there are so many monsters, so many Jericho giants. trying to put on you walls of Jericho. Yeah, Chris Jericho oh. looking perhaps to put Big Cass into the oh, wall. Way. Jericho, but not quite sure what the strategy would be here. <laughs> Maybe Chris is still suffering from a little vertigo. That shark cage. It was really high up there, King. I know. Oh! In the mouth. Jericho set over the top rope, lands on the apron. Remember, both feet must hit the floor. Jericho, high risk here. You don't have to want to go up to the top rope. It puts you in a position. Oh, 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 oh. Here comes entry number three. Number three. Jericho. And make it his first Rumble match appearance ever from SmackDown. The Mosquito. Kalisto. Number three. Remember, it was from the number three spot in 1992 that Ric Flair won the Royal Rumble match, went on to win the WWE title that night. Kalisto uh, running to the ring. Part the Royal Rumble match, but I don't know if it's the best. It's a maneuver. long run. Spent so much energy oh. coming down the aisle. Springboard drop kick. Like that, you need to conserve your energy. So it's plenty of energy left as a... Uh... Whoa. Kalisto. Oh, oh, it caught Jericho with a kick. That is a long trip down that aisle, you guys. Kalisto, oh, he's going to get eliminated. Also really curious. fast. Kalisto will be able to execute his... Five by Cass. Oh, my goodness. Uh-oh, in trouble on the apron. Oh, uh, Kalisto staying in it. In the ring apron. Offense as the ring fills up with superstars, but Kalisto doing very well thus far. And with Big Cass has caught him, looking to perhaps eliminate Kalisto. <laughs> Kalisto is elusive. Very quick. Look at that. Oh, uh -oh. that's embarrassing. Kalisto's in the legs. Oh, big boot. Down goes Kalisto. From Cass. Jericho going back over to Cass. Back to work on Big Cass. Chris Jericho closing in on history. Comes number four. Who's it going to be? I don't know. Who's it going to be? From SmackDown Live, Mojo Rawley. King, I have a feeling you like this match. Mojo. He's excitable. Mojo qualified in the SmackDown over the top rope challenge this past Tuesday night. 
And there's Mojo Raleigh. Mojo Raleigh. Resident blithering idiot. Blithering idiot? That's an insult to idiots. Mojo Raleigh. Oh. Oh. Mojo just hit a Raleigh. running tackle. Offensive style. Off energy. Flooring Jericho there. Now big cast. Mojo's height. Corner, right hands. And look at Raleigh he's going to get eliminated fast. Soon. In the corner. Mojo Raleigh played football at University of Maryland and for the Green Bay Packers. He joined other notable football stars to win the Rumble match like Lex Luger and Roman Reigns. Lori, I think his helmet was a little too small though during those photos. Well, Mojo's still in. Yeah, he already su surpassed what I thought he would. Probably be gone in a minute. Jericho and Mojo teaming up against Cass. Trying to lift him, throw him out near the corner. Wonder if it's every 90 seconds. New guys in, I believe. Maybe every minute. Here comes number five. Jack Gallagher, cruiserweight, the whitest man on earth. My God, he's white. Especially when they have lights on him. This is his umbrella. He's using his umbrella against everybody. Gallagher and Kalisto going in. Takes out Kalisto with his umbrella. Jericho from behind knocks down Gallagher. That was great. The umbrella is not an official entrant into the Royal Rumble match. First time I saw Jack Gallagher, he was wearing all black, and I thought he was a closed umbrella. Got all five guys, all five entrants in the ring right now. Umbrella under Jericho, right in his crotch. <laughs> he opens the umbrella under Jericho. That was funny. Open the umbrella, starts spinning around in front of Jericho. Tonight, William III will never forget, I can assure you that. Someone better take that umbrella away from the outside of the ring. Someone can fall on it. Get hurt. Told you five entries so far. All five guys are in. No one's eliminated yet. First guy to get eliminated will be Kalisto. It's my prediction. Comes number six. Number six. Number six. Mark Henry. World's strongest man. From Texas. Big pop for Mark Henry in San Antonio. Mark Henry, he's man, he's been around a long time. His first rumble was 98. He's been around a long time. Mark Henry's been in WWE for 21 years. Crazy. He's been signed since 96. Mark Henry looks like he lost some weight. Not as heavy. And uh, Big Show's also lost a lot of weight. Big Show's in this. Jack Gallagher tried to headbutt Mark Henry. Had no effect. Gallagher thrown through the second rope. Gallagher's not eliminated. Again, nobody's been eliminated. Jericho, Mark Henry, Cass, Kalisto, Gallagher, and Mojo all in the ring still. They're all in the match. Nobody's been eliminated. Been going for, I don't know, nine minutes, maybe, or seven minutes. 
What is going Gallagher has his umbrella. Jumped off the top rope with his umbrella. And Gallagher's eliminated holding the umbrella. That was damn funny. Gallagher eliminated by Mark Henry. And he's holding on to the umbrella. Tossed over the top by Mark Henry. Who comes number seven, two, one. Who is it? Please be Finn Balor or Samoa Joe. It's Braun Strowman. The monster. Braun Strowman. Well, I bet you he, elim he might eliminate all seven. He might eliminate all six left in the ring. He might eliminate all of them. And then he'll be all alone. Then I can see Brock coming out or Goldberg. Braun's guaranteed Braun will eliminate probably Kalisto, Mojo, maybe Mark Henry. Stupid Kalisto runs at Braun Strowman. Mojo going at Braun. No effect. Mojo splashes Mojo. Mojo just picked up and slammed. Mojo's going to be eliminated. Goodbye. Goodbye, Mojo. Mojo's eliminated, like I said. I knew I knew Braun would eliminate him. Cass. Oh, try to run him and kick. Cass eliminated. Big Cass eliminated. Kalisto doing three drop kicks on Braun. Braun grabs him. Braun is pissed. He's going to toss him over the top rope. Hip toss. Oh, Kalisto tossed into Mojo and Cass. Kalisto eliminated. Braun, Braun has three eliminations. Mark Henry now. Mark Henry and Braun face to face. Going at it. Punch for punch. Where's Jericho's on the outside of the ring watching? That's smart as hell. Mark Henry's gone. No. His feet are still in. No, Mark Henry's eliminated. Braun Strowman has eliminated four guys. Here comes number eight. Sammy Zayn, number eight. Braun's waiting for him. Here comes Sammy Zayn. Sammy Zayn. Can he do it? Can he last and go the distance? I don't think so. The underdog. Sammy Zayn punching Braun just got knocked on his ass. Jericho will not get in the ring. Smart move. So the refs should make him get in there. It's two referees. They're just pointing at Jericho. Get in there. He's not gonna get in there. Sammy's, I feel Sammy's going to be eliminated by Braun in a little bit. Sammy, oh, counter. It's a, oh, Braun ran into the post. Uh, Roman Reigns will come out, I believe, and Roman will interfere and get Braun eliminated. Because Braun screwed Roman earlier. So, I think we're going to see Roman come out. He's, I don't think he'll be in the Rumble. He'll interfere. Turn this down. Roman's going to interfere. Come in the Rumble. Spear Braun. Get him eliminated. Because Braun screwed Roman earlier. Back to the match. Sammy's getting beat down. Here comes number nine. Number nine. Be Samoa Joe. Be somebody awesome. Be a surprise. It's a big show. Now big show and Braun can face off. I think this guy can eliminate Strowman by himself. Big show might I don't know. Big show might be eliminated real fast by Braun. I don't see Braun going out soon. 
He'll probably last for a long time. And then Roman will get him eliminated. The Roman will distract Braun and get him eliminated. Maybe I'll be dead wrong. But I think Roman's gonna distract Braun to get him thrown out. Big Show Big Show looks skinny. Big Show looks like he's living in 96 again. His size. Last time he's this skinny was like 97, 96. And the battle, not the battle of the Giants, the battle of the Beards. Both of them got big ass beards. Big Show's much taller. Someone claimed Big Show is wearing lifts in his shoes. I don't know about that. And I don't care if he is. But I did see a picture on Twitter. Braun was taller than Big Show a year ago. And then when Big Show returned a week ago, then Big Show was taller. I don't get that. Sammy is, I'm glad to, happy to see Sammy didn't get thrown out yet. Big Show has a choke slam. Strowman gets choke slam. Jericho now. Jericho trying a cold breaker on Big Show. Knockout punch. That was really stupid, eh, Jericho. Jericho tried a cold breaker. Big Show caught him. Threw him against ropes. Knockout punch. Big Show lifting Braun on his shoulders. Now Braun picking up Big Show on his shoulders. Braun had Big Show up. They're both trying to lift each other, throw each other out. Big Show's gone. Big Show's going. Big Show's. Big Show's gone. Big Show, I knew it. Big Show's gone. Braun Strowman eliminated. Big Show, five guys. Braun is eliminated. Braun is dominating. But when Brock or Goldberg come in, it's a surprise. Ten. It's Ty Dillinger. I forgot about him. Number ten. Ten, 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 ten. Ty Dillinger. The perfect ten is number fucking ten. This is fucking awesome. Does this mean he's on the main roster? I don't know. Why am I shouting? Because I'm excited. Ty Dillinger, the perfect 10. The camera would not shoot his entrance, so I didn't know who it was at first. Perfect 10. I said in my uh, Rumble predictions, Ty Dillinger should be number 10, and in my Royal Rumble fantasy booking that Ty should be 10. So happy he's number 10. The perfect 10, he was the perfect number to be number 10. And the perfect guy to be number 10. Sammy and Braun, Sammy and Ty are teaming up. Beating the crap out of Braun, pretty good. Where did uh, Jericho go? Jericho, I believe, is went under the ropes again. Jericho's not in the ring. Double suplex to Braun. Uh, Braun is gonna. Braun does it. Braun hits a double suplex. James Ellsworth, E. T. Ellsworth. Ellsworth with Carmella, number 11. James Ellsworth, number 11. He looks fired up, but he's going to be eliminated in about four seconds. Or one second. Braun doesn't want to get in. I mean, Braun is waiting. Ellsworth is scared to death. Probably shit himself and pissed himself. Carmella telling him to get in there. 
Carmella trying to push him in the ring. This is funny as hell. Oh, I knew Ellsworth would be in this rumble. I knew it. This is funny. Oh, Braun. Sammy and Ty are going to eliminate Braun. No. Braun's feet are dangling. Braun's not going to go that fast. He's going to be at least the final six or four. Where the hell's Jericho? And guys, that could have been the best opportunity to eliminate Braun Strowman in this match. Yeah, but I can tell you this. Jericho, I believe, has not been eliminated. Where's Jericho? On the side of the ring, I can't see him. The giant ass uh, ring post is blocking where Jericho is, I believe. Number 12. Dean Ambrose, the Intercontinental Champion. Dirty Dean Ambrose. Go lunatic on Braun's ass. We know Dean Ambrose is absolutely fearless. We're about to find out what the lunatic is. It sucks that uh, Ellsworth has still not got in the ring. And Ambrose, former friends of Ellsworth. Dean is uh, pumping up Ellsworth to get in the ring. <laughs> and Dean fooled Ellsworth to run in the ring and Ambrose did not. It sucks that Rollins is not in the rumble. That sucks. I hope he appears and interferes. Oh, shit. Braun just threw Ellsworth over the top. The guy landed on his ass. And like his tailbone. Landed on his hip. Not good, man. That was not a good landing. Ellsworth lands on his hip. That was brutal. Ellsworth might be broken in half, folks. As good old JR used to say. Ellsworth is broken in half. Ellsworth gone in about two seconds. Ambrose now in the ring. I don't see Jericho anyway. I guess Jericho is thrown out. Jericho must have been thrown out. I don't know who eliminated him. I didn't see it. I think Jericho got eliminated when Ty Dillinger came out. Who's going to stop this guy? If it can be done, we'll find out tonight because 29 superstars number 13. I don't see anyone being able to do it. Jericho's gone. That's an unlucky number. Comes Baron Corbin, the lone wolf. Jericho's not at ringside. He's been eliminated. I don't know who eliminated Jericho. Probably Braun Strowman. Braun Lone Wolf. Baron Corbin going to face off with Braun. Braun's the only guy standing. Ambrose choking out Amp. Um, yeah. Four on. They're all double teaming. Four on one. Double teaming Braun. Strowman big boot to Corbin. Oh shit! Ty Dillinger's gone. Braun Strowman eliminates the perfect ten. Perfect ten is gone. Braun Strowman has, I believe, six or seven eliminations. Or eight eliminations. Uh, all three guys double teaming Braun. Sami Zayn, Dean Ambrose, Baron Corbin, and Braun are left in the ring right now. Corbin! Corbin! Eliminates Braun! Baron Corbin! Eliminated Braun Strowman. That's damn surprising. That is shocking. I thought it'd be Undertaker or Brock or Goldberg. Not Baron Corbin. Baron Corbin running clothesline. Running clothesline knocks Braun out of the rumble. Oh, Jericho's laying on the floor. 
I swear I saw Jericho. Jericho is laying on the floor. I think that is Jericho. Maybe it was Ty. New Day member. They get a huge pop. Kofi Kingston. Kofi. The first member of New Day to enter the Royal Rumble match. This is Kofi's ninth Royal Rumble. But think about all Kofi, the Kofi number 14. Kofi Kingston has survived New this day. New Day Rock. One of the greatest feats we've ever seen. No kidding. Kofi Kingston always spectacular, but you know he doesn't want to be known in history as a guy that always, almost... I want to see all Olympics. three New Day members in. Nope, nobody does. Nah. Kofi Kingston wants to witness it. I'm going to see all three of them then can work together. Now Sammy looking to eliminate Dean. Dean hangs on on the other side. Sammy, Dean Ambrose, Kofi, and Baron Corbin are in the rumble. Jericho, I don't know. Jericho may be laying on the outside of the ring. Man. I'm not sure. A big right hand by Baron Corbin drops Kofi Kingston. The stupid announcers. They haven't even mentioned if Jericho was laying on the outside. They didn't even mention if Jericho was eliminated. They didn't even mention it. So I'm really confused. I don't know if Jericho's in it. Laying outside the ring, the camera will not shoot him. I don't know what's up where Jericho is. Maybe he's in it still. Man, does Corbin hit hard. And Corey, can you imagine? Corbin's looking now, awesome. Baron Corbin. Corbin's looking great so far. Corbin was feeling confident. He feels like he deserves it. Kofi to be in the trying room. to lift up Sammy and Corbin and Ambrose are going at it in another corner. Comes number 15. I wouldn't bet against Baron. Be some Joe. And we're now halfway through. It's the Miz. The A Lister. I used to call them is the Z Lister. Of Royal Rumble matches, accompanied by his wife Marais, the Miz enters his. No longer the Z Lister. Miz is the A Lister. The guy's been great since he's been drafted. Since he's drafted to SmackDown. I was actually hoping the Miz would at least hang around till the very end because we would get to see Maurice, but she went to the back. So I don't really care what happens to him now. Can Undertaker is going to be definitely. Won't come in until after number 20, I believe. Sammy Zane. Same thing with Goldberg. Goldberg will probably be over number 25. Now five this past Tuesday night. Oh, oh, or maybe Goldberg will be before 25. And Ambrose, you know I Ambrose could see Dean Ambrose dangling. got thrown over, but he's hanging out. For now. I could see you know, Dean Ambrose. Would love to be the one to be able to say, Dean Ambrose, I could see lasting up until the final four. Year, Corey Miz was eliminated by the great Kali. Corbin, too. Braun's out. I thought Braun would be a final four, but Braun is out. So Corbin, I think Corbin's going to be one of the final four. Corbin just hit a Corbin vicious, his own momentum against him and like, vicious really deep that. six on a miss. That spinning backdrop. Everybody's trying to go after Corbin, but everybody's down. In the Corbin has a chip on his shoulder. Everybody's down except Corbin. Oh, hope he's still fighting back. It's really risky going to the top rope in this Royal Rumble match. Yeah, it doesn't take much to knock yeah, right Kofi the, standing on the, the top. What's he doing? He's Kofi standing on the ring post. Now, Corbin's got a sight set on Kofi Kingston. Oh, my God, Kofi! Oh. Kofi Kingston about impaled his... Kofi almost got eliminated, but he's hanging on, he's hanging on the ring post. The video screen on the ring post. He's hanging on, he saved himself. Kofi back in, hit trouble in paradise to Corbin. Corbin's out. Not out of the rumble, he's laid out. Now they're coming fast and furious. Like every minute, someone's coming in. Shane, oh, fuck. It's a dickhead shame ass. I didn't want him in the rumble. He shouldn't be in the Rumble. You already had a match. Well, the Royal Rumble match from the 22 position. Uh, Cesaro is definitely going to be in it. Do it what a way to redeem the evening. Yeah, you lost your tag team championship, but you can still... I hope Corbin knocks Sheamus out on his ass. Royal Rumble matchup. 
Only Sheamus and Randy Orton. Sheamus taking everybody out. Four or more final fours in the Rumble match over the past decade. That's how good Sheamus has been in this match. Celtic Warrior laying waste to everything moving inside the ring. Yeah. Yes. I don't blame you, I'd run too, Miss. Oh no. Miz about to get beat in the chest. Ten shots. Eight, nine, ten. It was Jericho. Jericho just got broken. So Jericho is back in it. Obviously, I knew he wasn't eliminated. Minimize the impact. On the ring post, but I don't know incredible, incredible athleticism. I can't believe Braun is gone. I thought Braun Strowman would be the final four or final two. Oh. Ambrose is I mean, I shouldn't because Braun cost Roman the title. That means Roman and Braun are going to face each other at WrestleMania. I should have knew that, but I didn't think about it. I thought Braun might have a chance to win. Who's number 17, I think. New Day member. New Day. I think it's Big E. Because he's screaming. And the surprise is it's number 17. Who is it? Big E. It's Big E. Number 17. I cut the sound off for a minute. The surprise is I want to see Samoa Joe... I'd love to see Kurt Angle. If Kurt Angle appears, I'll, I'll, I'll go nuts. I'll, like, I'll explode. I'll go crazy. Then they'll go against each other, but till then they gotta work. Biggie, uh, Biggie right locks the Miz in a domino stretch, spanking him. Oh man, spanking him. Jay rocks. New Jay rocks. New Jay rocks. And spanks on the Miz. Uh, Kofi and Big E in the rumble at the same time, they're kicking ass. Kofi, Big E, double teaming the Miz. Miz is gone. Miz is going to be tossed. Uh, Miz is holding on. Take a look at the corner of the matchup of Baron Corbin and Sheamus. Too big. Sammy, I'm, superstars Sammy I'm surprised Sammy, Sammy Zayn is Sammy still in. Sammy is in control right now. But this is what's great about the Royal Rumble match. You see matchups and collisions you never thought you'd see. And we are now awaiting number 18. Oh, Jericho. Where is Jericho? I don't see Jericho. Maybe he's not in. I don't know, I don't know where Jericho is. It's Rusev. Number 18, Rusev. Things are gonna change now. Oh my god, look at Lana. Good lord almighty, look at Lana's dress. Oh, Lana. Marry me, Lana. I never met you in my life, but I marry you. Last year, he entered number two. Rusev has a mask on. There's a mask over his nose. I don't know why. Rusev had a mask on his nose. The guy must and broke his nose. Rusev protective shield over his face and nose. Is there a broken bone in his face or broken nose? Somebody over that top, their feet hit the floor. See how many guys are in. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight guys are currently in the ring. Big E, Kofi, Baron Corbin, Sami Zayn, Miz, Sheamus, Rusev, and Dean Ambrose all in the ring. In the Royal Rumble. Eight guys in the ring. When Undertaker comes in, when Brock comes in, when Goldberg comes in, a lot of guys are going to be thrown out, I feel. I want to see Samoa Joe. Samoa Joe better be in this. There's been rumors. Cesaro. And here comes number 19. 
My voice is getting sore. Cesaro, number 19, one half the tag champs on Raw. I want to see Small Joe appear. The guys, uh, Cesaro swing on The Miz. Cesaro swing on Sami Zayn. Crazy. Come on, stupid network. Trying to refresh. Just keep swinging. Use him as a weapon. <laughs> this guy's down. Sammy sti still in the Cesaro oh, swing. Now Dean Ambrose getting a Cesaro Ambrose swing. Dizzy. <laughs> Ambrose doesn't look like he likes it. Kofi. Kofi getting a Cesaro swing. My God. Oh. Big, big ass, big <laughs> Cesaro's blown up. Cesaro's dizzy as hell. We tried to uh, swing Big E, it didn't work. Oh man, Cesaro swinging Corbin, but barely. Oh, Sheamus, swing his ass. Swing his ass over the top rope. Swing your partner over the top. Oh, Rusev super kicked Cesaro. Rusev through some careful strategy with the last man standing at the moment. I mean, Samoa Joe, he's been rumored. He better be in this rumble. If there's no other surprises, I'll be happy if I just could see Samoa Joe debut on the main roster. I don't need to see Kurt Angle. I would love to, but I don't have to. And, um... Finn Ballard, I'd love to see him return, but I don't think he's going to. Number 20. Number 20, Xavier Woods. And Xavier Woods' very first Royal Rumble match. I don't know, King. We always hear the dude they talk about their unbreakable bond. There's a lot of guys in there, man. I think, I think it's ten guys. In. This may be the situation that destroys the New Day. All New Day, all three New Day members are in the Rumble at one time. Kofi and Xavier beating the crap out of Sheamus, double teaming his ass. Comes Big E now to hit a big splash on Sheamus. Big E, big splash. Hell, man, this damn refreshing. And the network fucking load. It's pissing me off. They're still trading rights and left in the corner. Oh, oh, oh. now Xavier still an it lands on the apron. Kofi kicks him off <laughs> on his shoulders. Xavier, Xavier, Xavier Woods who saved his buddy. So many guys in the three. Kofi for another stop. Four, dangerous situation. Five, six, seven, eight, 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 eight. Think ten guys. He is in trouble now. Oh, oh man! Like a pair of new day boots. Four, five, six, seven, eight, eight, nine. Nine or ten guys are in there. It's still hanging on. I believe nine or ten. Oh, what Randy uh, Bray Wyatt. Wyatt music. Who is it? Orton or Bray or Luke Harper? Luke Harper, if he, Luke Harper faces off with Bray in this, Luke is going to turn on Bray, or maybe Orton will turn on Bray and Luke and throw them both out. Are you kidding me? It's probably helped prepare Bray Wyatt better than any other superstar. WrestleMania, it's rumored that Bray's going to take on Randy. So Randy's probably going to turn on him, hit RKO's out of nowhere, and screw them out of the Rumble match. Ton of fireflies. Ton of them out in the Alamo Dome. 50,000 fireflies. Bray Wyatt, number 21. On his own. Without a... Without a wife family member. Oh. Miz. Oh, oh. oh. Miz got slammed hard by Bray. Bray takes out Ambrose. Bray takes out Cesaro. Bray takes out Rusev. Bray takes out Sheamus. Xavier Woods. Remember the issue between Xavier Woods? 
Xavier and Bray, and Bray staring Wyatt at each other, going face to face. Xavier Woods is completely terrified of Bray Wyatt on every level. And Xavier Woods looking to put that fear behind him as he runs in. Uh-oh. And Bray's got his sister Abigail. No. Oh, Woods, Woods countered it. Oh, man, what a oh, clothesline. clothesline. That was awesome. That was a hell of a clothesline. Stay in the back and play this video game you know, channel. Fucking and Bray Wyatt sound card all this shit. Dominating Snap Now Live with Randy Orton and Luke Harper. New Day and Cesaro and Sheamus again. The history between them we've talked about. Again, if we don't get no other surprises except Ty Dillinger and Samoa Joe, I'll be really happy. But I'd like to see Finn, but I don't think we will. Comes number 22. And I'd love to see Kurt Angle, but I doubt it. This is... Um, there comes Apollo Crews. Apollo Crews. I forgot he's on the roster. Apollo Crews. Number 22. Not trying to be funny. I forgot Apollo Crews was part of the roster. Insanely strong. Guy's really underrated. You're right. All and, the and Apollo Crews is misused. Misbooked. Creative has handled him awfully. Nice standing moots on him. Apollo, Apollo Crews looks like a million bucks. Guy's a damn good worker. And the guy's a great look. It's really crowded in there now, isn't it? And still on the apron, Xavier Kofi. Well, look at still hanging in there. Kofi, uh, Biggie's holding Kofi, Dragging and Woods, he pulled them in. They're, oh no, oh no, all three. All three New Day members eliminated. Stupid shame ass. <laughs> Jericho appeared from outside the ring. New Day, all three members eliminated by Cesaro and Sheamus. Then Jericho comes in, eliminates the Raw Tag Champs. Y2J, baby. St. Raw is Jericho. The Rumble is Jericho. Jericho is outside the ring a long time. He must have been under the ring. Cesaro, Sheamus facing off on the outside. They look pissed. Look for number 23. Randy Orton playing his I Hear Voices theme, not the Wyatt's theme. And Brandy, not Brandy, who's Brandy? Uh, maybe Bray and Randy had a baby and they called him Brandy. I'm just kidding. Randy Orton, the look on his face, he looks like a baby face. He looks like he's going to take out Bray. Randy and the Wyatt, and the Wyatt family, that is not fit. He needs to, he needs to go ape shit and RKO everybody out of nowhere. He needs to RKO Bray and Luke Harper. He's Bray, Ray, Ray, what am I saying? Randy Orton, RKO out of nowhere to Baron Corbin. RKO out of nowhere to Rusev. Rusev may just had his nose rebroken. Sami Zayn's gonna get an RKO off the second rope. Sami Zayn from the second rope. Top. Oh. oh. Sami went up to the top and got an RKO out of nowhere. Sami Zayn now you need some new teeth. Randy picked up Bray Wyatt with his arm. Helped up Bray. New Day's gone. Cesaro Sheamus are gone. No more teams except Randy and Bray. They're the only team left. Well, Luke Harper's left also. Goldberg, Brock, Undertaker. They're late. They're really late entries. Be Samoa Joe or Kurt Angle. Please. Dolph Ziggler, 24. So 25, 26, 27. Brock Goldberg, Undertaker. 25, 26, 27. That leaves four more entries. Luke Harper's another entry. 
So three more entries after Luke, Undertaker, Goldberg, Brock. Four more entries left. No, three more. Three more left, I believe, after those four. It's not going to be Roman. It's not going to be Seth. Luke, Undertaker, Goldberg, Brock. That's four. There are only six more names are left. Six more names, and I counted four of them. Now Dean and Dolph going at one another. So the other six Jericho more, I counted four. One of them has to be Samoa Joe. The four more left. I think there's six more. Fans are chanting Goldberg. That's their piped in chants. I don't know. I'm sure some fans are excited to see Goldberg. And we now look for number 25, Tanner the Prey. Number 25, so five more guys. There's six more guys. Luke Harper is next. Three more guys. Goldberg, Brock, I got counted. Goldberg, Brock, Undertaker. The three more guys and, and three more. I don't know. Three or two more left. That'd be awesome if uh, Finn Ballard was number third. So there's a lot of guys in there. Now. Miz. Apollo Miz, Jericho, Sami Zayn, Bray Wyatt, Randy Orton, Luke Harper, Apollo Crews, Dolph Ziggler. Apollo Crews is gone. Harper eliminated Apollo Crews. Harper staring at Randy Orton. They're having a face off. Bray gets in the middle. And Randy's going to R-Kill Bray. When Bray turns around, he's going to get R-Kill. No, he's not. Oh! Spinning clothesline from Harper to Bray Wyatt. Harper turns on Bray Wyatt. Finally. Luke Harper standing up for himself. Guy's an awesome big man. He should get a push. He should get an inter uh, he did have an intercontinental title run, but he's very short. I just I can't believe what we just witnessed. My guy now, look at look Harper's gonna hit Sister Abigail on Bray. Oh. Bray White saved. Save from Sister Abigail. Luke Harper, RKO by Randy Orton. And Luke was going to hit Bray with a Sister Abigail, but Orton broke it off. <coughs> 26. One of them's got to be Brock Taker Goldberg. It's Brock Lesnar, the beast incarnate. With Paul Heyman, Brock looks ready. He looks fired up. Comes the beast. He's gonna F five a lot of people. So after Taker Goldberg. There's only two more names, two more spots left after Taker Goldberg. One of them, Gabby Joe. Ambrose eliminated. Dolph eliminated by Lesnar. Lesnar's going ape shit. Suplex City. Germany. Another suplex to Jericho. Suplex to Baron Corbin. F5 to The Miz. Randy Orton gets an F5. Brock is destroying everybody. Sami Zayn is... Sami's going to get eliminated. 
Everybody's laid out except for Sammy. Eat, Bingo. sleep, eliminate, repeat. Everybody's laid out. Watch Goldberg be next. And Brock's going to be the only one left standing. Goldberg's next. Watch Goldberg be next. The luckiest number in the Goldberg is next. Over the years from this spot, who has it? Better be next. No. Goldberg's not next. Enzo Amore. I think I know what this means. My dad, Corey, you can get your wish. Oh my God, this may be the greatest moment of my life. Everyone's laid out. Enzo Amore is going to Brock's the only one standing. With the beast incarnate Brock Lesnar. Enzo's gone. Just turn around and go back to the locker room. Enzo running to the ring. Keep running straight ahead into the storm. Don't even bother getting in the ring. I am you, Enzo. Don't even bother getting in. Lesnar with a little smirk on his face. Enzo, don't even bother getting in. Put your shirt back on and go home, Enzo. I agree with Corey Graves. Go home, and Go home, Enzo. Oh. Enzo clotheslined to hell. Guy did a backflip. He's history already. It didn't take long. Goodbye. Enzo's gone. Enzo eliminated about 20 seconds. 30 seconds, maybe. One clothesline. Brock tosses Enzo. Jericho's still in. Rusev. Go. It might be Undertaker next. Number 28, it's coming up. Goldberg hit a regular suplex. That's surprising to see. Luke Harper's still in. Baron Corbin's still in. Jericho, Bray Wyatt, Randy, Rusev, Sami Zayn, I think. Still in. Goldberg. Here comes Goldberg. Everybody's standing. Goldberg's waiting. I mean, Brock's waiting. Brock is standing there in the middle of the ring waiting. Goldberg standing in his fire pyro. Here we go. Now it's going to get interesting. He's found it as one more championship for him. In order to have that Goldberg looks in great shape. Brock is a beast. Goldberg and Brock gonna face off. They might just stare at each other. And then Undertaker might come out. They might just stare at each other for a whole minute. Brock looks ready. Brock's jumping around. Goldberg spears Lesnar again for the third time. No. What the fuck? Goldberg just closed on Lesnar and eliminated him. Goldberg eliminated Brock in like 20 seconds. Ducked a clothesline, hit a running spear, and then hit a clothesline. Goldberg has eliminated Brock Lesnar in about 20, 30 seconds. Goldberg just clotheslines Corbin, clotheslines Rusev. Jericho gets clotheslined by Goldberg. Fires Brock. All right, running the ring. All right, running their F5 Goldberg. So I was Brock out F5 Goldberg's ass. Sammy Zayn gets jackhammered. Now Bray and Randy. This is interesting. Bray and Randy double teaming Goldberg. They're gonna throw him against the ropes. He's gonna duck. Clothesline and he's gonna hit a double spear. Here it comes. 
52,000. Cabo Spear. Cabo Spear. 52,000 people are stunned. Goldberg bounced right off the ropes very I, I, I sloppy. Looks tired. Goldberg the, the, the fat falls and spears and them both. 29 is to be Samoa Joe or Undertaker or Finn Balor. Who is 29? The Undertaker. The Undertaker. I, I think it's a waste. I think it's a waste to have The Undertaker in this if he's not going to win. That's just a waste. Take, Taker's in the ring behind Goldberg. Taker's already in the ring somehow. He must have been under the ring for the entire damn show. I don't know where the hell he appeared from. I don't know how they do that. Goldberg and Taker facing off. Taker has Goldberg by the throat. Corbin beating up Undertaker. Baron Corbin wants to make a name for himself. What better way to do it than Col to take the Undertaker? Corbin going after Taker in the corner. Goldberg eliminates Rusev. Undertaker. Undertaker. Spear. Undertaker speared by Goldberg. Taker's up already. Goldberg's eliminated. Taker was speared and he got up real quick. And went behind Goldberg, threw him over the top. Here comes the Miz, not wasting any time. The Miz. The Miz and Sami Zayn double teaming Undertaker. Taker fighting out of it. And Taker looks like he's kind of a belly. I'm not gonna bash the guy. He's a legend, Godfather of WWE. Choke slam to the Miz. Miz gets choke slam. Sammy's gonna get a choke slam. Undertaker's winning, but here's number 30. Who is it? Please be Samoa Joe. What? Why the fuck is Roman in it? Why would Roman be in it? The guy just had a fucking title shot, and he lost. This shit's stupid. No Samoa Joe? No Finn Balor? What the fuck? I don't fuck? understand why Roman Reigns would want to enter the Royal Rumble match, but after what Roman... Why is Roman in the fucking Rumble? The guy lost the title shot. Bray Wyatt is absolute... I hope Braun Strowman comes out and eliminates Roman and gets, distracts his ass. Taker's waiting for Roman. Taker's in the middle of the ring. Why is Roman 30? It's, it's stupid as fuck. Stupid as fuck. Really stupid. Whoever made thought it was a good idea, let's have Roman face off with Taker in the Rumble. You're a stupid idiot. Stupid idiot. Who, I don't care. I'm trying to make Roman look strong by facing off with Taker. Taker just big slapped him. Beat the fuck out of him, Taker. Beat the fuck out of Roman and toss his ass over the top. I don't know where Reigns is getting the power behind those rights, but they were rocking the Taker from there. Because everybody is down except Undertaker and Roman. Roman got a title shot. Why would he be in this? AJ Styles wasn't in this. Roman lost. 
the Universal title match. AJ lost his title match. AJ doesn't get to be in this Rumble, does he? Choke slam that fucker. Roman gets choke slam. I'm pissed. pissed. If Undertaker doesn't win, I'm gonna be fucking furious. If Undertaker gets thrown out by Roman, I'm gonna be furious. Miz is gone. Sammy's gone. Sammy lasted a really long time. Sammy must have lasted about 40 minutes, 45, 50 minutes. Why is Roman in it? Fucking pointless. I, I swear to God, if Undertaker... No! Fucking Reigns just eliminated Undertaker. You motherfucker. That fucking sucks. Undertaker staring at Reigns. He's pissed. Taker probably going to face Reigns at WrestleMania. That sucks. I'm pissed. I'm going to go. I'm going to say I'm picking Roman Reigns. I'm going to change my pick. The fact that Roman Reigns had the guts to eliminate the Undertaker and then so you think, for his yard, that's my guy. think it's a good idea, WWE, to have Roman win another Rumble and try to keep pushing it. It's not a good idea. It makes me sick. And it's pathetic. But you keep trying. Jericho's gone. Jericho's hanging on. He's going to get Superman punched. No. Jericho on the ring apron. Jericho up to the top. Superman punched. Roman Superman punches Jericho. Jericho's gone. Bray, Randy, Roman. Final three. I'm going to try to... I'm going to call the rest of the match objectively and not freak out. Final threes, Bray, Randy, and Roman Reigns. I just got to say one thing, man. Screw being objective. If Roman eliminates Randy and Bray, that's fucking bullshit. That's him being fucking super Roman. That's stupid, dumb, fucking stupid ass, dumb ass shit. If Roman wins, that's stupid as fuck. Why, why no Samoa Joe? Why no Finn Ballard? What the fuck? This could be his moment. Bray Wyatt looking to eliminate Roman Reigns. Sorry, any kids watching this. Sorry for all the cursing. Sorry for all the cursing, but that's what I do when I get angry. That's what adults do. Bray's gone. Randy. It's Randy and Bray. Randy and Roman left. Stupid. RKO out of nowhere. Yes! Randy wins. Thank God Roman didn't win. Thank you. Thank you, God. Randy wins. That's, that's to get to a round of applause. Randy Orton gets Roman, tosses him out. 
clotheslines him over the top. Thank God Roman didn't win. Oh. Roman eliminates Undertaker. That's going to set up Undertaker Roman, I'm pretty sure. Watch this. Clotheslined over the top. Get the fuck out of the rumble, Roman. You should have never been there in the first fucking place. Stupid ass booking. Putting Roman in there. Just to make him look strong by eliminating Undertaker. Dumb as fuck. Dumb ass decision. Randy Orton. Royal Rumble winner for 2017, the Viper, WrestleMania Pyro, WrestleMania sign, Pyro going off, Orton pointing at the sign. Pyro going off, Rumble. Rumble 2017 going off the air. Randy Orton, the Viper, the 2017 winner. Good night, everybody, from San Antonio. 52,020 WWE fans. And I'm spent. I'm spent. Royal Rumble 2017's in the books. Oh my god, I just, I still can't get over that they actually put Roman Reigns in the Rumble. I can't believe they would do such a stupid thing. Stupid idiot. But thank god Roman didn't win. Randy Orton winning gets a round of applause. Randy Orton, I love Randy Orton winning. And not Bray, not, not Bray, I would have been happy if Bray won. I'm happy Randy won, and not Roman. That's awesome, that Randy won over Roman. But my God, why even put Roman in there, when you could have put in Samoa Joe, or Finn Ballard? Oh, Samoa Joe should have been in that rumble. I don't know. I guess they don't want Samoa Joe. They didn't want him to be eliminated. Maybe they want him to debut looking strong. So I'm okay with Samoa Joe not debuting in the Rumble. The only surprise was Ty Dillinger. That's it. At number 10. Thank God Randy won. Thank God Randy won. Stupid decision to put Roman in there, but thank God he got thrown the fuck out. But he still eliminated Taker, Jericho, and a lot of people. Oh, uh, if it's Undertaker Roman at WrestleMania, I hope Taker kicks and beats the fuck out of him and defeats him with a tombstone. So Roy Rumble's in the books. This ends my live reaction to the 2017 Royal Rumble match. Hope you enjoyed this live reaction. It was a very long match. My throat is sore. Hope you enjoyed it. Even if you watched five minutes or two minutes of it, hopefully you enjoyed it. And my Royal Rumble live reaction to the Royal Rumble 2017 is in the books. Like share, subscribe, comment on my videos, follow me on Twitter at WWE NXT Guy. This live reaction was imperfect. I had the network freaking reloading, refreshing on me a couple times and stopping and refreshing. I apologize for that. I couldn't do anything about it. It wasn't a perfect live reaction, but I thought it was decent. Hopefully you enjoyed it, everybody. Now, I'm going to do my Royal Rumble review video and have it on my YouTube later. Bye for now, everybody. Randy Orton, 2017 Royal Rumble winner. 
That is fucking awesome.